G'day, I'm Evan, and welcome to Gaming Gaming Game. Joining me on the show this week, it's Naomi Higgins. What's up? I'm Naomi. What they say? Michael Hing is here. And Greg Larson. It's good to see you, Greg. What are you? Huh? Nobody clap for me. Oh, I'm I sorry. You were gonna clap. That'll be great for sync, though. Yeah. Well. <laughs> the clap. The single clap. having a single yeah. isolated Which camera clap. am I looking into? Any, any? Oh, just Pex over there. <laughs> <laughs> Hot damn, you're going to get us taken down off Twitch. <laughs> um, you just really didn't try with the mic cord, did you? No, I, no, I did. Like, I put the mic pack in my pocket. Yeah, but you're supposed to, it's supposed to go up. But why? What's all this on your shirt, Greg? Like you had like a front what? seam What's all on this on your shirt? shirt? Stays crumbs. <laughs> I was eating Red Rock Deli. You're looking like a real grub today, Greg. Do I really? <laughs> I mean, you might want to hide the microphone. I, well, fine. Okay. No, that's fine. Whatever. I, I, what does my hair look like, honestly? I think it looks fine. I'm really worried. Oh, uh, I don't want to. Thinking about getting transplants. Give us a look. Yeah. Oh, uh, your hair looks great. And I don't know what to do with yeah. it. I don't know what to do with it. I, like, are you taking the pills? No, I'm not taking the pills. But they don't regrow hair. How much does it cost to fly to Turkey to get it done? Because I was talking to someone recently who was planning on doing that. Yeah, Turkey? Like, Turkey. Turkish. Yeah, you go to Turkey. You go to Turkey to, Turkey to get hair transplants. Are they good? Because I've what? seen other people get other stuff done in Turkey. Mm. The, the teeth. I think it's teeth, quite worrying. I think teeth and hair is quite big in Turkey. Turkey teeth? Yeah. Turkey. Have you ever seen turkey teeth? Well, I think the finished product's good. Obviously, the, the shaving down bits are no, a bit No, no, no. The product as well. What is it? Well, first of all, you're not supposed to shave your teeth down to nubs. No, no, you're not veneers. meant to, but they do it in Turkey. People no, do no, it. you're not yeah. supposed to do it for veneers. Oh, they well. just do it for fun for I'm some just, reason. I'm just telling you, I've seen some horrifying I'll, pictures on the internet. I want to get, I just want to get the nubs. Like, oh, that's all I want. I just want the nubs. I want to be like, ah, and I've got nubs and people go, ugh. You're going to go to Turkey for that? You just yeah. get a Dremel. A Dremel. <laughs> Is that yes. a drill? Is that a drill? It's like a the spinny thing. Yeah. A Dremel. Mm -hmm. Hello, Evan. Hey, how you going? Uh, a bunch of men at the table. <laughs> it's great, we just took a break and it just feels like we're like right back into it, you know? Uh, That's right. What did you get up to over the break, Evan? Oh, not much. Bit of, bit of rest. Uh -huh. I went to the Titanic experience. That's not called that. The Titanic. <laughs> oh, we got this. Ocean Gate, what did you do? <laughs> <laughs> what were you? Um, no, but one of the you Ocean Gate just guys before that one. runs it. The, Is that the one where it was a restaurant and then people were growing marijuana on the roof? Uh, they were growing marijuana? I don't know. Just, yeah. just before we went no, to air, yeah. what did the producer say? They said, don't defame anyone. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. That was, it's not defamation if it's true. I'm not kidding. He said, there, is it? He didn't say it is. There, okay, no, well, was, is there? We hang it's a pedophile. There, Do you was, know what I mean? Like, we could all. No. It was in the news. I read it in the news. I swear to God, I read it in the news. There was actually a Titanic themed restaurant okay. where they were busted for growing like marijuana on the roof. I'm I think this might be different. This, this is like an artifact <laughs> exhibition where that you go and they've got all these yeah. artifacts. <laughs> not everything's a restaurant. Greg. Was everyone was everyone smiling? <laughs> sometimes. No. What sometimes, <laughs> sometimes things are restaurants. <laughs> what? Sometimes it's just sometimes it's just an exhibition. <laughs> that doesn't have to be. Then what's the fucking point? If it's not a restaurant, why? Well, they, they do actually have some high tea there. Oh, okay. Well, they, hey, <laughs> but that was I too expensive. There we go. We didn't do that. Yeah. Um, they've got, you know, it's an experience. You go there and they've got like bits of the Titanic that you can look at. Mm. They've got like, what, bits? Pe you know, uh, you know, like um, bolts or um, bolts. You went to a museum. That's what. To see some bolts. <laughs> yeah, there's like rivers. Was it a bolt? Was it? They could just show you any bolt, and what? How would you know? It, you just how have would to you know it was the plaque? I think. Bolt. You just have to take their word for it. I guess it, I that's suppose. the case with anything. <laughs> it's, well, no. If you go, like, I went to a museum and they, I saw a bog body. You know, like those bodies that get like preserved in a bog. Preserved in the bog. What yes. bog? What bog? What bog? A, an Irish bog. <laughs> It was like an I don't know about these bog bodies. Yeah, these, they're real bog bodies, but you, it's, you can't fake a bog body. You can't <laughs> fake a bog body. You can't body. fake a bog body. There's too much detail. Uh, but that's just your opinion. Okay. No. <laughs> uh, it's famously they science. They have a person being, no, there being like, yep, that's good. Science has never been able to figure out how to do a fake bog body. <laughs> they can fake a lot of stuff. Bolts, Coke cans, not a, not a bog body. Um, 
Okay. Were there any no, bog it's good. bodies? No, it's good. Like you get, no, no, no. But you go in you and you, it as a big bog. you get given a like a boarding pass of like so you can you're one of the passengers from the Titanic. Fun. And okay. then by the end you get to find out if you survive or not. Oh, did you did you survive? I did survive. Were you I was in first class. Rich. I was in first class. Yeah. Son of a bitch. <laughs> you piece of shit. You uh, love this stuff. Come on. I do. I do love this stuff. But we you have got to a talk piece about. Of coal from Titanic. I right? did have a piece. Of, yeah, I've got it. Yeah, yeah. It's one Bullshit. of the only things. It's one of the only things they can sell because they're not allowed to sell the uh, artifacts. But why? So wait. So someone? Nah. <laughs> so someone has gone onto the Titanic and gone save the coal. Come on, we gotta save the coal. It's shit yeah. sinking. Like get some coal, put it on the lifeboat. No, what? no, 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 no. They went what? down and went. They went down there after it sank and got they, the coal. They dove down. <laughs> yes. They went. <laughs> But why do they get the coal? To sell it. <laughs> to sell they it. Can't I guess, sell yeah. anything because else. they can't. Yeah, that's the only way they can't. They, they can't sell like the captain's by hat or whatever. Coal that was in the Titanic. They're not allowed to sell actual artifacts. Yeah. Um, you thought there was coal in the life. I thought people were that's that's bullshit. Salvage coal. <laughs> that's bullshit. <laughs> I still nah. <laughs> nah, it doesn't add up. Um, You're asking all the right questions, Greg. <laughs> no, it's good to clarify this stuff. Mm. Um. This week, yeah, it is good. Uh, we are talking about Power World. But first, what do you think of this? A recent study by The Conversation looked at how Australian English teachers view video games. Many of them are open-minded, with 60% saying they think video games are legitimate texts to study. But several teachers still have very negative attitudes, with one calling them a stupid fixation and continuing, quote, forget digital games, it's not the 90s. <laughs> um, are, they, are they suggesting that video games have come and gone? I think so. That's I think right. I think this person maybe thinks that they're a fad of some sort from the nineties. What, what I want, what the 90s, I, the peak of gaming. Mm. Um, Legend suit Larry et al. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Spice Girls on PS One. <laughs> the um, Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> I, what what what? Are you thinking about restaurants again, Greg? No. <laughs> what, what are you talking? I'm talking about Sonic. Not yeah. Well, Sonic's a restaurant in the, in, in America. Really? Sonic's a restaurant. <laughs> um. <laughs> what, would it be annoying if I did this the entire show? Uh, yeah, kind of central, I think so. Right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's that's interesting. You give um, the wonderful <laughs> camera person something to do. They've got to. No, but yeah, it's bother me personally. I, I yeah, I'm, I'm not going to do it. Okay. But <laughs> that would be crazy. This let's come on. Can we get on topic, please, everyone? Um, <laughs> on this, can we? But, but, what when they talk about teaching video games? Are they talking about teaching? The art of making video games, or are they talking no. about just teaching? No, this is like this is English teachers. So like Study. instead of instead of studying a Shakespeare play or something like yeah. that, uh, we're talking about whether video games are a legitimate text. Why do you have to say to Shakespeare play? Like I don't know. What are you studying? Opposed to a class? bloody what's, Shakespeare. What's eating Gilbert Grape? Oh, okay. Well, that's a great example. Of a, a more, a, yep. Why are, you some, mad at, why are you mad at Evan? Some people study I mean, Shakespeare. I it's not going to stack I mean, up against we're, Shakespeare, is it? What are they going to... Uh, uh, but, what? So, kids, what, what do you think that they mean when they say push X to jump? <laughs> <laughs> well... <laughs> What's the <laughs> subtext uh, when, they, uh, when they say uh, pre press start to play? Um, is that, is that, that Mario? X? What does Mario mean? What, is, what does he mean when he's saying press start to play? The X is actually a reference to um, when people die and the crosses go on their eyes. I oh, think That it's yeah. like foreshadowing for the fact that in the game that you might die or other people might die. So you, stud you say you studied Gilbert, what's it in Gilbert Grape? The book or the film? Is there a book or film. is it just a film? Just a film. Oh, I went to a very bad school. Well, I don't know if there's a book. <laughs> I came um, into year 12 and I realised that pretty much no one in my class had read all the books we had to read for the class and I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I really thought I was doing the bare minimum here and I was like top 10% by default. What's like, the, what's like the dumbest thing you had to study in English class? Because I had to, we had to do Clueless, the movie Clueless. That's cool. Oh. It was, it was cause it's a, it's an adaptation of like a Jane Austen oh, yeah, novel, yeah. we had to compare them. But it's quite, it's quite, I just think it's kind of unfair to, to make a bunch of kids compare a cool movie that was made for them to like a stodgy old text that has a lot of big words in it that no one enjoys. The only thing... Yeah, fuck that bitch. The only Dang. actual... The, the actual no, 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 my words. <laughs> the only thing I remember from English class is I had a mate who once got like a... this. Cr I couldn't believe how long the thumbtack was. Like it was... <laughs> It was like it was a thumbtack, sure, but it was, it was like nail? an extra long thumbtack. No, because it had the full, 
The round bit at the, the end. The round bit, and it was wow. like really pointy and thin, mm. and it was just quite a long thumbtack, and he just pushed it all the way into his arm and went, check that out. And I went, ugh. And then he pulled it out, and then it just bled all over his sleeve. Like his whole sleeve was red, and then the teacher was like, you gotta go. <laughs> like you gotta go. Like you can't be in here like that. And everyone was like, what the fuck is wrong with him? <laughs> hey, what's he doing now? Is he a cop or something? Or? Last, last I heard he was like really, the last time I, I interacted with him, with, with him, he was like talking about how the Liberal Party was really good. <laughs> he was really into it. So I don't know. Um, That's great. So oh, there's some interesting... So, so you so, didn't go to a prestigious school either, no. I'm guessing. Yeah. You didn't go to a fancy school, Greg? No. <laughs> I mean, I did, I did, I went, I did, I... I did go, I went to two high schools. Where I, oh, you Did you get bullied out of one or? Yeah, I got, <laughs> yes, I did actually. I <laughs> went to Red Bank Plains High, which is a really rough school. Um, they bullied poor Greg. They, poor they, sensitive Greg. They beat me up. They stole my clothes and my it's, hat. <laughs> <laughs> this, this one kid, he fucking stole my hat. I had this hat, cause you just have hats that just say like American football teams. You just buy from Kmart. Like I had this hat from Kmart that said like you didn't Dallas Cowboys. Did have school Cowboys. hats? No, no, oh, not it's a Redman. Not a Redman. Not a Redman. high. It didn't have a school hat. We just and I just had a baseball cap that said Dallas Cowboys on it, right? And this kid in my class stole my cap, and then the next day he'd just gotten like a blue pen <gasps> and just drawn over the star so it was blue, and he was oh. like, "Yeah, that's a different. It's a different cap." <laughs> and I'm like, wow. "That's my cap, dude." And he was like, "No, it isn't." And then he beat me up. Wow. Well, then I had to go to a different school. And it was the, cap incident, the cap incident was what made your parents remove you from the school. There was a lot of things. Someone threw a, an eye at me. Like, you know in science class when you have, like, the bull's eye? Oh. You know, I don't yeah. think of you as being an easily bullied person. Oh, I was really bullied. <laughs> Someone threw a lit cigarette at me once. Oh, really? Oh, damn. Were, were they, like, being like, do you want it? Or was it more aggressive? <laughs> yeah, yeah. They... <laughs> She wasn't offered, very athletic. Offering you a smoke. You know, no, no. It was um. It was in this, school. If you went near this one place, it was like, you get bashed. Jeez. Yeah. In, in, in the playground. In the playground? <laughs> well, I don't know. I don't know. Is this like on the way home from school? Like, where is the place to not get bashed? No, no. It was like, a, it, it was called the seats. and the back of the oval was, or something? It was on the side of the oval. Okay. Oh, okay. So Jason's in the like, playground. Even teachers didn't go there. It was like, you're asking wow. for it, you know? Oh, damn. Go near the seats. And then I talked to a girl at a private school and I was like, where's the area of your school that you can't go or you'll get bashed? And she's like, I could go anywhere. I won't get bashed at my school. I'm not scared to go anywhere in my school. And I was like, that's weird. <laughs> You're crazy. <laughs> I, um... No thumbtack in the arm though. <laughs> I'm trying to understand. But one boy in my class did try to light one of my friend's hair on fire. Oh, yeah. It sounds like we're in similar environments. Yeah, well, at least for the first high school. I, 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 I ended up going to a private school after that. Oh, okay. So Is that why you're such a fine gentleman now, Greg? Yeah. No, but it was, in fairness, it was the cheapest private school in Ipswich. Oh, everyone says that. <laughs> it was. And let me guess, you were the poorest one there. It, no, um, there was this real <laughs> ratchet kid that was so <laughs> poor. He didn't have shoes. We just kept picking on him all the time. Um, and that was the thing. And that's the thing that made me feel better. When I got to this private school, suddenly I was from Red Bank. And like I could bully people. Oh, so and then I was uh, like, oh, this feels really good. <laughs> yes. Like it feels good to bully someone and make yourself feel like a big. Yeah. Wow. And yeah. So you continued the cycle of violence. Yeah. yeah. And, yeah. and have you learned any le lessons since then? Um, yeah. Uh, don't be a dweeb. <laughs> don't be a dweeb in high school, um, where you'll get chucked into a bush <laughs> by some year twelves when you're in year eight, and you'll be like scared to go to school and then you'll bring a bread knife to school and then everyone makes fun of you because you had a bread knife. And they're like, what are you going to do with a bread knife? <gasps> they, Channel right. 7 showed up at my school once because someone brought a bread knife. Really? And it was like, exactly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck yeah. are you going to do with what a bread knife? What are you going to do with a bread knife? Now, is this uh, what you wanted to talk about, Evan? What, uh, what happened at your school, Evan? Oh. Were you bullied? Uh, oh, yeah, sure. Yeah. yeah. Were you bullied? Uh, I was... Yeah, a little bit, of course. I yeah. feel like I can't imagine yeah. anyone at this table not getting bullied. No, I was, um, <laughs> I was in, initially kind of bullied. I, I did the, I would so do, I did the reverse Greg. I went to quite a fancy school mm. in, in in early high school, mm. and then sort of got bullied out of that, and left. Um, uh, also, there was there, there I went to a school called Trinity Grammar. If you Google the school. 
there were there's quite a lot of real bad shit going on at that school. Mm. So I'm very glad I left. Um, but then I went to Caring Bar, which is a school of nerds, a public school full of nerds, and. I was sort of a... Um, you poor thing. <laughs> yeah, you know... Is that an academic selective? Yeah, 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 yeah like yeah. a proper fucking school. But, but um, it, it was a, basically, it was in a place called the Shire, which is a very white area of Sydney. And so I was kind of like a novelty <laughs> as an Asian person. Hmm. And so I became, I think, in retrospect, quite problematically, something of a mascot to the kids. Um, <laughs> We had one of those actually. <laughs> like an Asian who you're like, yeah. hey, hey, hey! We had one Asian guy. Yeah. I mean, there was, there was many, it was a selective school, so there were several Asian yeah, people. Oh, okay. We only like, had one Asian. But I was, I, I, was, I was made into something, I, I got to. Anyway. Wait, so why were you the mascot then if there was a bunch of Asian people? I was the most talkative of the Asian kids. You're just dancing around. <laughs> yeah, I like, you know, I, 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 I once, I was. I'm in a koala. Our, 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 like the pick me. I was on the uh, water polo. Yeah, yeah, I was on the water polo team. You were on the water polo but, team. But I wasn't any good at water polo. I just got to, but they put me on the team because they would just sort of lift me up and throw me around and stuff, you know? What school is this? Like. That has a water polo team. That's Car a, pri that's a public school. Carrying my heart. No, it's a private school. No, no, it's, oh, a no public it's a public school. school. It's a water polo team. Yeah, my but it's but it's a fancy public school. Yeah. Well, it's like a it's like a nerd it's like a nerd public school. Yeah. I I I, 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 I want to try and understand what this this person has said. And this teacher has said, oh. um, mm. in it's this open response, they say it's right up there with Twitter as a suggestion for enhancing English skills. That hasn't taken off either, despite tedious. Desperates in the profession who insist on trying to make it the next big thing. It's like trying to bring back Boy George or something. It's so 90s. Forget the digital games. It's not the 90s. Yawn. I don't understand what they're. Wait, what, so bringing what are they, Twitter in, like online writing, is passe. Yeah. Like Boy George. Yes. Maybe, maybe in the 90s there was a trend to use more multimedia sources in English literature teaching. Maybe. Maybe I think, I think what it is is like you know when someone you know like when you have people that go like oh fucking snowflakes mm. like shut up you snowflakes but then people who get called snowflakes start going oh maybe you're the one who's a snowflake it's like that it's like it's they're trying to go this like this is really uh, like wait <laughs> I've got it in my head I've got it in my head because it's like. He'd be accused of being like old school, and he's like, actually, video games are really old school. Right. Like it's okay. it's like when your it's parents project, try to tell yeah. try to tell you not to get a tattoo by going, if you get a tattoo, you'll just be like everyone else with a tattoo. So you'll actually be more of a conformist uh, with a tattoo. <laughs> you've, got, you've got some tattoos. Yeah, I got a couple. Of you've tattoos. got a bullet there with butterfly wings. With butterfly wings. Oh, I like wow. the song. <laughs> uh, now, did you get that at a? <laughs> did you? What? Did you get that at an age? When you were still living with your parents? Um, no. I so did you, what, did your, what did your parents say when they saw that tattoo? They went, oh, yeah. Like the song. <laughs> they went, what is it? What and then song? I said, it's a bullet with butterfly wings. And heaps of people have said, is that a vibrator or a dildo? And I was like, no. <laughs> it's a bullet with butterfly wings. What's the, what's the song? It's called the, it, Bullet with Butterfly bullet, Wings. Bullet, bullet with Butterfly Wings. It's, it's, it's by a band called The Smashing Pumpkins. The spider on my... Oh, is this copyright? No, go for it. The spider on my rage, I'm still just oh, a rat right. in a cage. Did you think that was going to get DMCA'd by the algorithm? They're going to um, be like, this yeah. is so close to the original song. Yeah, it's, it's like Billy Corgan himself. I mean, you are balding. Yeah, so, I, am, I am balding. I have, like Billy I have Corgan. Fucked teeth. He's clearly insecure about it. I have fucked teeth <laughs> and I have weird views about Trump that I'm not fully saying, but... <laughs> Clearly, I'm into Trump. <laughs> um, uh, someone else said, I really hate video games. They steal something from children. What do you think games are stealing from children? I agree, actually. I agree with that. I what, don't steal. What do you, why? What? I think they give you too much dopamine. But I think that that's about not, that's, technology that's giving in general. You something, not stealing but don't something. you play a lot of video games? Not really. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, this is the wrong show. <laughs> I thought you were like a... I'm just here for the vibe. I thought you like streamed oh. video games and stuff. I haven't done that in like two years. Oh, okay. But like... <laughs> I, I haven't kept do, up with your do, life. <laughs> there's video games and there's video games. What do you... What do you That's true. Like there's... Like, you know, you take something like The Last of Us Part 2. Yes. That's, that's art. <laughs> oh, that, that's because of the, the sort of literary story in it. There's a story. Yeah, right. Yeah. That's obviously I mean, what they're talking but about. But what about like yeah. Tetris? Yeah. Like Tetris, Tetris is like... Because like, they're making Tetris into a movie now. Tetris is quite like... 
I don't know. It's fun, I guess. It's a puzzle thing. Oh, wait. Do you mean the movie Tetris? Isn't there a movie coming out about Tetris? There's already a movie already about, about the yeah. making of the game. Oh, it's about the making of the game. Oh, okay. And it's one of... It pisses me off so much because it's one of the worst movies I've ever seen. Oh, really? I and it's like such a good subject matter. A yeah. guy makes a game in the Soviet Union and he's not allowed to have any royalties for it. And then another guy gets the rights to it. It's a cool story. And the yeah. movie sucks so much. Oh, that's okay. a shame. Maybe you yeah. could redo it. Um, I will. You could play. You could play one of the blocks. Change. Or something. You could be the it's, tall boy. It's not about the blocks falling. That's no, you not could, what the movie. You could play like the I'll L one, the square one. <laughs> the square what about the block. one that has Imagine, three and I then one on the top? Body dysmorphia or something. <laughs> what? What if? What if there was a remake Tetris called Greg Tris, and everyone was just me in a different pose? Like there's just me going. I like that like idea. Like there's the line, you and then you go. Make that. I think. Yeah, what? I think you can make I think that. You should. Yeah, yeah, I think. I don't know how to make. Sorry, I, I think. Draw a I think of King it, Evan or I could easily make that. <laughs> yeah. He won't, but I think that you should. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but like, but there's so many games like your for, your Fortnites and your. Do you, yes. do you remember the video games you, you, that we were playing in 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 school? Like, do you remember the games? <laughs> yeah, what are you, what? Your Fortnites. Your Fortnites and your bloody your Roblox, blocks your and your TikToks yeah. and your okay. muck about fantasy boys. Yeah, and your Roblox. <laughs> but like the games that are just microtransactions and gambling. Yeah, that's. I think that's when they they have a point about technology ruining children in that way. I think we're all breaking from that. I think it's. I think we're going mm. down. Yeah, because yeah, right. like where games are going isn't like oh let's make really cool stories to tell. It's let's make these kids addicted to gambling in a way that's legal. Oh, it feels so good though, doesn't it? Yeah, gambling. Mm. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, my niece spent more? a lot of money in Fortnite when she was like six. Who? <laughs> my niece. Wow. Mm. How do, you spend money in, how do you spend money in Fortnite? What are you purchasing? You buy like V-Bucks. Skins or something. Oh, right, yeah. Mm. Dances. Mm. You can purchase a dance. <laughs> you can just go outside and do a dance. You tell them, Greg. You can just go outside, <laughs> like, touch some grass, do a dance, um, shoot a dog. Do you, <laughs> <laughs> um, do you guys remember in high school occasionally, sorry, in primary school, mm. you would occasionally be given computer time? Maybe I'm 400 years yeah. old. Did you, yeah. you, did you, uh, and you? And you had to, well, you, yeah. you got to sit on the computer in the corner of the classroom mm. and play whatever bullshit game that installed. Uh -huh. one, one of ours was about, I think it was called Crossing the Mountains or something, and it was like sort of pioneery kind of, you know, mm. you, you go across the mountains and stuff. <laughs> um, you, you've got to pick a yeah. wagon and some shit. I don't know. Mm. It's the Australia. It was like the Australian version of that, I think, or like the rip-off Australian version of Oregon Trail. Yeah. Right. Um, uh, it was another one called Gumboots. Did anyone else play Gumboots as a kid? Boots. Like, Are you no. just bringing up stuff? For yeah, just going to somewhere. Okay. Or, I thought maybe you guys. I remember have... playing a game. <laughs> I remember playing a game at my cousin's house called Astro Tits, and it was a game. It's a true. It's a true game. True. I swear to God, it's a true game. It's based on a true story. It's a true story. That, and, but this is. This is these are the kinds of stories that our kids should be learning. Uh -huh. Because what this game was was like it was a little dick and it, it goes down the thing. And there are all these tits. This is true. This is real. This is a true and these game. Tits would fall down and it'll go doo -doo 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 -doo, and shoot sperms into the tits and they'd blow up. Right. And it's in a space setting, hence the astro. I see, right. And then right. like, but also condoms would come down. You have to avoid the condoms. Oh my God, yes. Because you'd get a floppy and then the dick would go. Bruh, 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 bruh. And, and oh, then, I don't know what that's instilling. And then, <laughs> and then if you, yeah, don't, please don't use a condom. It'll fuck up your life. Um, and then at the end of the game over screen, if you type S-E-X, sex. Yes, <laughs> thank you. It would come up with this really bad pixelated just cartoon of like a man and a woman having sex. Oh, good. Right. How old are you? Um, I was like eight at the time. So this is, I'm, yeah. and I'm guessing when you were eight, there was less access to. Yeah, it was stuff. like you had to, like I didn't have a computer at my house. Like I had to go to my cousin's house who had a computer. Mm. Um, and how old and was your cousin who was playing this game? Two years older. Mm -hmm. Well, because you know, it wasn't like a 35 year old man showing you this game. Oh, lots of men, you know, in the room we were in was, there's a lot of men, a lot of people, a lot of, <laughs> there's a lot of stuff going on. Um, okay. Maybe well, we should, move, maybe, I, I don't know, I'm thinking maybe we should move on from yeah. this. I think, I, was I think it's fun. Uh, I don't think there's many games worth studying for the writing. I think there are lots of games we're studying for the writing, but but oh, maybe that's not. Stupid and you're wrong. <laughs> I think that makes me think that you're stupid. And look, maybe I am. Name three games 
worth studying for the writing? Uh, the Last of Us. That you can't. There can't be two of them. Oh, that's two. That is two games technically. Uh, <laughs> um. <laughs> um, the Last of Us remastered. Uh, the Last of Us Part Two. Mass Effect. Yeah, Mass Effect. Sure. What did you do with your voice just then? Well, I said Mass Effect. <laughs> Why did you sound gay? Mass Effect? <laughs> no, that's not right. <laughs> what about Call of Duty? Call of Duty has some great uh, single player campaigns. Incorrect. Okay. Incorrect. But I think what games They're all just about murdering brown people. Also, they made me play Stardew those Valley. games. But that, but, but, Stardew but, Valley. But, but, yeah, you can but, marry the doctor. Yeah. That is, you think that's the text worth studying? Well, yeah. I, what about um, Red Dead Redemption 2? Red Dead Redemption, Red Dead Redemption 2. 2. The Red story? The story that I thought was quite good. Yeah. Good enough to study yeah. in Can class. Can I just say, the yeah. story doesn't have I don't to... Know. The, I'm studying the, Clueless. Like, the, what do I the, care? The, I'm studying Jane Austen. <laughs> which I've never read. <laughs> <laughs> the story, in my school, we didn't even have Jane Austen. <laughs> Genuinely. <laughs> the story doesn't have to be good in order to analyse it, though. Like, you yeah. can... Yeah. You can like you people could don't analyse bad books in don't school. They? they don't choose them as top. Like okay, all the books you, you I tend, read You tend to go, like, here's an example of good writing... Why would you, you analyze? How to write good right. You make right. all the kids what? in the yeah, class read a bad Nothing. book. <laughs> well, I don't know. What the fuck I didn't are you like any about? of the books that I read. I oh, neither did I. In my life. I read Catcher in the Rye. Oh, I hated that little bitch. Yeah. <laughs> he was so annoying. <laughs> he's just, he's just, just complaining about story. everyone the whole time. Ah. Uh -huh. And he's and he's basically the same as them. That's the point of the book, obviously. Okay. But I hated it. Right. Those oh, you know what games have great stories? Those yeah. ones where you see, I never have played one yet, but they say like, you won't last five seconds playing this game. You will come. Dudes come within five seconds every time they play. I've seen you ads You cannot for those not games. come for those games. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, I've Did never, you play them? I've never been able to get my hands on one. <laughs> no, you, I thought you were going to say you've never been able to last longer than five seconds. Yeah. No, what's crazy, right? One day I decided, I think I was wanting to do this for like maybe a podcast or something. I was just like, I want to play one of these. Oh, for research, Greg, for research. No, I want to like, I want to know what happens. You're monetizing your porn viewing. Yeah, can I, can I, I don't, I don't know what that is, but <laughs> I, I was like, can I, can I get one of these games? You can't get them. Like you so click, what are they advertising well, it says for like then? click here and then it's just like, do you want this game? Fucking yeah, you can play this game. Click here, and then you just want a site that's just sells porno DVDs. Right. It's like when like, this is like ten. You years. Just feel like you're in this loop of like, where's yeah. the game? This is like twenty years ago when I was looking for ROMs. I always wanted to download yeah. ROMs, and you just go around in circles looking at ROMs, and it's like there's no, there's no, no ROMs here. Yeah, there's there's no just no Lincoln, so it's just well, mm -hmm. sometimes. Yeah. When I, I worked at a video game television show for a while, and as part of that, you get sent games to review all the time, right? Mm -hmm. And I was shocked by the amount of people writing to the ABC asking us, ostensibly a children's show, to review their extremely pornographic games. Oh. They'd be like writing to like, you know, Bajo or whatever, being like, hey, here's one with big tits, you want to have a look at it? He's like, no, this is, the, this is, we're on the ABC, this yeah. is not. Um, so what I'm saying is, Greg, if you want some pornographic I mean, por they put Greg game, on the ABC. What, sorry? <laughs> yeah, Greg. It was really mean. <laughs> 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 Um, uh, so if you want some pornographic games, yeah. I'm sure if you went into Steam and typed yeah. in, you know... Oh, I think there's pornographic games out yeah, there. Big Naturals or something. Yeah, big, or, 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 um, big Juicy uh, Naturals. Um, honk, honkin', Hog City. Hog, <laughs> Hog City rockin'. I think Hog those City are rockin'. fake, Greg. I don't think they're real games. I'm really sorry. Yeah, no. I'm just... Uh, Chat points. What? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Power World. It's what game, game did you study too Outside much in here. high school? Are you owed an honorary doctorate? Should we keep video games in the classroom or are they still really cool? That's actually a good point. You know what? This reminds me of how they made Taylor Swift a, a subject. Or no, a degree. You can get a oh. degree oh, in Taylor sure. Swift now. They, they, oh, so, really? Like, American unis do this all the time where they go, they pick a celebrity and they go, we're well, going to offer a degree mm -hmm. in that. And they expect like, finally the kids will want to come and learn with yeah, us. Yeah, they're just I, desperate for enrollment, surely. What I do like though is when you say they made Taylor Swift a degree. I love thinking about who they is in that <laughs> sentence. Like, who is they? Oh, it's not a university. <laughs> it is not a university. It is real weird. <laughs> it's the Illuminati. These guys in that room over there. They a lot of hoods. Don't go in there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's not just the stands you have to watch out for. There's <laughs> big black powers at play. Power. I tweeted something negative about Jacob Elordi. And I have to say, 
the few people that were mad at me, they were quite nice about it. Okay. They were like uh, talking to me on a first name basis, you know. Uh -huh. I think the insults what, were above the belt. What were you mad at Jacob Elordi? He's, he's, he's an Australian. Maybe skip this bit. Fair enough. <laughs> oh my God, Beck, you gotta, the law or you the gotta law? calm down, okay? I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say anything. I'm not gonna say anything bad. Can I ask for a f just a factual statement of who this person is? Who Jacob Elordi is? He's, in, he, he's an actor. He's an Australian actor who's gone to the US and become very big. Mm. And he was recently in Sydney and got into a fight, I believe, with a radio producer in an eastern suburbs Sydney pub, I think. Mm. And uh, the police were called, but I don't think anyone was arrested. Outside a hotel. Yeah, there was an altercation. It was a Kyle and Jackie O producer mm. versus. <laughs> this actor, but I made a joke about him, like we need to, we need to um, cancel the passports of boys who went to St Kevin's. Is that the school he went to? Yeah, well he went to another one in Queensland, St Joseph's or something, I don't know if you know. Oh, I've vaguely heard of it. Anyway, I just made some joke about how we need to like stop until, until everyone is, is immune to toxic masculinity that's a little bit gay, um, because... Not sure if I can laugh at that, but continue. That's what it is. They're like... They're like, ah, oh, I'm different from other guys because I flirt with my male friends. <laughs> but then, <laughs> but then I'm pretty sure they've all killed one woman each. <laughs> Interesting. That that does sound think... defamatory. Uh... <laughs> I said I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I think you could take everyone that went to any school that starts with Saint whatever, uh, mm. um, any Saint Joseph, Saint Paul, Saint any Saint, and then a bloke's name. Mm. You could just put them in a machine. And just or grind them up. Just goo them up. Goo them up. Feed them to dogs. Yeah. I did go to one of those. All right. Oh, I'm, <laughs> there are some good ones. No, there are some good ones. No, sorry, Evan. Into the into the goo machine. Okay. No, no. no, Evan's gonna know better than us, aren't you? Yeah. Did you go through some stuff? <laughs> what? I didn't go through anything. Do they okay. really play soggy sayo? What is that? Oh. Don't. <laughs> you. Yeah. I actually have the craziest story. Okay, well, part of this vendetta is I like briefly dated a guy who went to St. Kevin's and I was like, that was the worst person I ever met yeah, in my life. Good to know. But I don't think I can tell the story on here, but oh. we'll, maybe on the break. So you're a biscuit, oh. aren't they? Yeah. yeah. I see. You're, the way you've said that, <laughs> what is soggy sayo? It's not like a biscuit. It, it, it feels what like could it, it be? Know? It feels like there's a Bullshit. part of your brain that is blocking a very traumatic <laughs> memory for you right now that we don't don't exactly. want to access. Exactly. He probably was the sayo. Yeah. <laughs> no, you don't. You don't use. You don't use an Evan like a sayo. Evan's Ev, Evan's got eating stock. You know. I don't know what. <laughs> okay, so soggy sayo <laughs> is a game oh, no. that. <laughs> At every boys school, there's a rumour that they all play Soggy Sayo. <laughs> so That's what like, I mean by a little bit gay. Yeah, it's like every boys school has this rumour like, and, and everyone will go, no, they, I swear to God, they actually did it at St. Peter's or like they actually did it at Ipswich Grammar. Mm. There's always a rumour. Soggy Sayo is when a bunch of, you know, young, rambunctious teens. Just straight guys. Yeah, Just straight, normal straight guys. Straight Guys, straight as a die. Regular fellows. They're, they're boarding. They're always boarders. Mm -hmm. They're uh -huh. in the boarding house and they get a sayo biscuit mm -hmm. and they stand around the sayo biscuit. <laughs> I don't know why, you know, like we don't have to laugh at this. It's just, you know, different strokes for different I thought types. there was like a screen involved or a no. A it's screen? Just a... a screen. A screen for? I've never heard of a screen. Do you mean like a screen as in like a blocking screen? Or no, sorry. Or I mean like, an like iPad? a TV screen or a laptop or something. Oh, maybe just to get them. Mark, because what they do is they. We don't need them. to. I, I mean, I get the. I think I get. The and, and, and I think you need to hear it. Hear me out. <laughs> okay. okay. So I think you get it. They masturbate. I see. Onto the sayo, onto <laughs> the, the the cracker. Mm. Uh -huh. and the last person to ejaculate on the cracker has to eat it. Right. And it's got, there's a dog whining. <laughs> <laughs> I can hear a dog crying. Burning him. <laughs> Um, um, there's also another variation hmm. called chocolate biscuit. Now, what chocolate biscuit <laughs> is? La, 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 la. It's the same thing, but with a chocolate biscuit. I feel like I reviewed a game like that at Good Game once. Mm. Really? Mm. So you do review stuff like that. Mm. Power World. Power World. Everyone's talking about it. Power. It's the <laughs> <laughs> I just every time I upload an episode of the show, you got to go through the YouTube thing and and you have to tick tick the boxes and yeah. submit like basically a content rating. Oh, sure. And, what are you um, going to tick? Well, a lot of things, what evidently. Are what are we... Tick? Usually it's So you just... should be glad that I didn't tell the other story. 
Uh, which other story? Doesn't don't, matter. Don't, it's don't. not important. <laughs> I mean, it probably falls under the same broad categories that we've... No. Okay. Is there, is there, is there anything left? For, is there anything higher than soggy? Like, if you type in soggy save, does that immediately give you an R rating or can you go higher? I, I would expect that, that we'd, be, we'd be at, a, at the level of limit. We'd definitely be at limited okay. uh, ads at, at the moment. So does that mean limited? You, what does limited mean? It means you can't, so you can't means, make money out of this it, it means... We're costing you money. Well, yeah, we but, but it's always kind of... The, so it means you get limited ads. So obviously some advertisers will, we can, can choose to opt out of videos oh, that, right. that hit like certain stuff. The SAO company. But why some of them won't care. Wanna, why wouldn't they want to be... A, um, can, can I just say that I have... I have Googled Soggy Save. I knew it. I oh, knew yeah. it. You Googled an image, didn't you? There's a Wikipedia article. Oh, yes. Okay. And it's called Soggy Biscuit. Oh, okay. Soggy yeah, Biscuit. I've heard of it. It's Soggy Biscuit. And then, but then there's some great alternate <laughs> names. Okay. And I'd love to share them. Uh, yeah, um, okay. Let's... Soggy Biscuit, also known as Ookie Cookie. <laughs> <laughs> Limp Biscuit. That's where they get their name from. Interesting. Wet Biscuit. Shoot the Cookie. <laughs> Jizz kit, like biscuit. Oh, no, that's jizz. too much. Okay. Or, less inventive, come on a cookie. <laughs> it's a male group masturbation activity <laughs> in which participants stand around a biscuit, in brackets UK, or cookie, in brackets US, <laughs> masturbating and ejaculating onto it. Mm. The last person to do so must eat the biscuit. <laughs> Under pain of death. Um... Additionally, a participant who fails to hit the biscuit when he ejaculates must then eat it. The game is reportedly played by adolescents, notably in the United Kingdom, United States and Australia. In Australia, it's also known as Soggy Sayo after the Sayo brand biscuits that are popular there. <laughs> Wait, so you could come and miss the biscuit? And yeah. then you're fucked. Then you yeah. can eat the biscuit. Yeah. Then it doesn't, you know. And you'd be like, oh no, I hate eating the biscuit. No, don't feed me the biscuit. But at least, at least if you're the last to come on the biscuit, you know that... At least some of the cum is your own cum. But then, like, if you miss the but biscuit, none of it's But if you're the last to come, then you don't have to come, do you? You just eat it. Yeah, but you still would. Like, <laughs> you're going to play Soggy Sayo. You're going to lose you, the you game. Wanna, you're you're going to want to You want to dilute the rest of the cum with some of your own. But why, why do you want to eat your own I, I, I like I like this line here. Soggy Biscuit is associated with homosexuality. <laughs> is it? In what way? I don't know. They don't really know. elaborate. Prove it. Yeah, is that cited? Yeah, it's like it's yeah, it's not cited. Citation not needed. Cited. You got to edit that page. This, um, this, I want you to add dubious. I believe I will. <laughs> this is um, gross. That Chat's sounds like a gross it, obviously. Game. Hello, chat. I'm glad I never played this game. My grandma's watching this. Um, is what is what oh, Waldo little says. Feet, little feet pics coming up. Um, Power World. Power World. It's a monster-catching survival and crafting game currently in early access. It's been pretty aptly described as Pokemon with guns. Let's take a look at the trailer and you'll see why. Hey, that, uh, that was a look at the trailer for Power World. Uh, I, uh, I guess... And nothing else happened. <laughs> it's 
Nothing else happened. <laughs> as far as the YouTube viewers oh, know, that's, that's, camera? that's <laughs> yeah. Um, do you want to do it again? No. It's okay. One more. One more take. And nothing else happened. All right. <laughs> nothing else. <laughs> all right. I'd say this is my pal world, right here. Hey. Um, my three closest friends. You gonna bash us? What do you mean? That's what you do in this. What's my? Oh yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna help you up with a meat friends? flavor. What's huh? my middle name? Yeah. What? What's my middle name? What's my wife's name? Greg. Greg. My, my middle <laughs> name is Greg. <laughs> Greg Greg. <laughs> I'm Gregory Greg. I thought you didn't have a first name. I'm Greg Gregory. I'm Greg Gregory Gregson. <laughs> Greg Greg Larson. Greg Greg. Greg, Greg. Greg Greg's kind of funny. You know my, my my name is Gregory. Yeah, but Greg Greg's a funny sound. Greg Greg. Yeah, Greg. Greg. Yeah, Greg, Greg. Greg. That's what that would be. Greg. What that'd be your Pokemon. That'd be a good pal. That'd be a Pokemon. Greg Greg. <laughs> what was it? And it's just me. Yeah, going. that's kind of how I see you. Greg Greg. <laughs> Greg's here. Greg Greg. That's a cool little pal. You got a pal. You got a pal world pal. So let's talk um, about Power World. Let's talk about Power so, 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 so this is um, mm. this in it, this is a game. You, 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 start, you it's, a, it's, a, it's a survival game. Are you alright? You, uh, yeah, I'm just trying to. You what know, are you? It's, uh, I think are you stressed. like trying not to say something? He's trying to edit this while he's <laughs> doing it. Mm. Mm. I, I, th this is the survival game. <laughs> you play as a person. You make yourself a person. A survival at the start. game is that like rust? You make yourself uh, a person. Well, you know, you're a character. You're, you know, there's a character uh, editor. What's, what's another survival game? <laughs> what's another survival game? The forest. I think rust is a survival game. I think it counts. As, yeah, for sure. The forest. Is Ark? the forest. A survival Ark is survival. Game? I don't know this for the forest. The forest. Any game where you have to eat, otherwise you'll die. How about that? Yeah, that's the a, forest. I think that probably counts. Yeah. What about forest. real life? That, I think um, real life is a survival well, game. Thank you for saying Fall, it. Fallout New Vegas, if you play on the setting that makes you have to eat. <laughs> is that a setting? Yeah, there's a setting on Fallout New Vegas where you can do, go like realism and then you just have to eat. You oh, get hungry and then you eat. All right. Fallout well, New Vegas. Do you, um, do, you, do you add that mechanic to all games, Greg? <laughs> <laughs> Any game. And I eat when they eat. <laughs> That's <laughs> you ever play drinking games? I play eating games. Ping, I think you're like, contributing to this man's poor self-image. Yeah. I, I love Greg. I, 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 we're really struggling. Like they put the chips in front of me, and I can't stop. No one's eating any of these chips. He, he's talking me. like he's a caricature. Yes. And you I'm a jolly man. <laughs> I'm jolly okay. and I'm fat, and I love to be fat. <laughs> I think you have a lot of good qualities. <laughs> yeah. Greg, Greg, Greg. I think you're a layered man. <laughs> Not literally. Um, uh, Greg, we love you. Really appreciate your uh, taking the time to be here. Hey, I'm drinking Pepsi Max, so <laughs> no sugar. Yeah, yeah, uh huh. Um, I. Uh, so, 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 yeah. It's a survival game. You're, you're, you're in the, you're in this world. Of sort of a <laughs> of pals, of pals, a world of pals, and there are there's pals everywhere, there's and that's so kind many of all. Pals. That's kind of all there is. There's a couple of people, but don't worry about them. The main thing Why? is why they won't be friends with you. Uh, so they, all right, I should say I played this. I didn't enable this multiplayer option, so there may have been more people if you mm. enable the multiplayer option. Oh, so there are mm. other players hanging around. They're you know NPCs. Um, oh, just people. They don't. I, I, I don't know. They didn't do anything when I was. Talking to them, they're boring. So I just went around with the pals. Um, so, so well, it's so, power world. So yeah, it's power. So there are oh, pals God. around there, and, and the pals there, they're, they're, oh. they're, they're your friends, right? Pals are your friends, and so um, you weary. you go around, and you can all you can really do with them is bash them, and then make them work for you. Yeah, um, like like that's what friends. <laughs> that's what friends. That's for. what friends do. That's like that's when the, when I first met Michael, mm -hmm. for example. Right. He bashed me and put me to work. I bashed him and put him to work, and we've. Been been friends ever since. It's been great. It's been a great decade, guys. Yeah. Um, very rewarding. Yeah. Yeah. But that's but that's essentially how it, how it works. Yeah. You 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 um you you bash yeah. the pals. Yeah. Um, or you know hit them with something or whatever, and 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 then you you um you throw a, a pal sphere at them to capture a them. A pal sphere. A pal sphere. Interesting. As so legally you throw a distinct. pal sphere at yeah. this. Pal. pal. That's right, yes. And then they're trapped yeah. in the pal sphere. Yes. Yeah. That's right. 
How novel. Uh, and then you can you can uh, throw the pals, you can re release them to, and then they can fight for you. And then the pow your pals can fight other pals, and then and then you can but capture them. And so you know, it's, yeah, it's really really shit. Like, uh, it's a, <laughs> you didn't enjoy the game. I, it's, you played a bit of it today. I, well, in fairness, mm -hmm. I played it for ten minutes before we recorded. Okay. Okay. Yes. And from my ten minutes of playing, yeah, sucks. And well, then I played after Greg. And yeah, what do you think? Well, I thought, I don't really know what to do because Greg's just killed the character, so I don't have any clothes or any food or any weapons, yeah. and yeah. it's freezing. So you and think it Greg was just die. bad at the game? What did you do to my character? What do you mean? Is it your character? <laughs> Is that your, like, I thought that was just like a muck around account where you can just play. <laughs> Greg? Oh, yeah. I, I, Greg, Greg worked Greg out was a having secret. trouble killing like a little penguin thing and then saw this like huge fuck off monster. When I'm oh. going to get it. Yeah, and I thought I could get this monster and then it just killed me straight away. But right. That's not I true, spent... you got some hits in. But each yeah, hit was hits. like 1 HP yeah, one down hit. and it had like 1,200 HP. I'm not, I'm not surprised that you didn't enjoy this game, Greg. Because, but all... well, because uh, my, my understanding is that when you and I lived together for a bit during the Comedy Festival, mm. um, you brought your ex you were living in Queensland at the time, you brought your Xbox down to Melbourne mm -hmm. and while we were all sort of going out during the day and going to restaurants and cafes and enjoying Melbourne life, you were sitting at home for, I would say, eight hours a day playing like a motorbike game, a, a, a um, I think it was like a motocross game where you had yeah. to do jumps and stuff. Yeah, trials. <laughs> uh -huh. Trials. And, it wasn't and, Trials and, HD, I think it was Trials. Yeah, but, but you were so obsessed with that. And I remember talking to you at the time being like, what, what, what is, like, this game is so boring, I can't understand why you would enjoy this. But if that's the game you love, of course you're not going to enjoy Power World. I'm but, sorry, I take issue with you coming in here and being like, I'm the normal one, I go out and socialise. Unfortunately. And Greg's weird. In this instance. We're playing a game when he's working It's all relative. At night. It's all relative. Yeah, I was, I was working at night. Also, I had, I was on the, I had very little money. I, I was on the dole when I was <laughs> down at Melbourne Comedy <laughs> Festival. It was a big point of tension between um, myself and my parents. Um, I had to ring them up halfway through. So I couldn't have a lot of money for activities. So I brought my Xbox and I just played Xbox. It's funny because we couldn't afford enough beds. So Greg was sleeping on a lounge mm. and then Sam Campbell, the comedian, was sleeping in a little nest at Greg's feet. Yeah. It's kind of it, was, it was more like, what, what is it called? Like an ottoman. He basically yeah. had like an ottoman where he, he curled up. He was on the ottoman? Yeah, and, yeah, he, had, he, and he had like four towels that he kind of yeah, like... Towels? Yeah, he yeah. made a nest. Not a blanket? No, 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 no. Well, I don't think we had enough blankets. We didn't have enough blankets. There was a nest. It was a nest. Okay. Was, I don't think there was a point where you didn't have money. Well, I, Why didn't you just buy a blanket for these poor boys <laughs> who are sleeping on ottomans and using towels as blankets? Well, they seemed happy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, pals without beds get stressed. I imagine it's be similar. I think Sam yeah, was yeah. driving. I think they got nominated. Didn't you guys get nominated for an award that year? Maybe? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. We that was like that was that that was our harsh wake up call. Like we were doing quite well, and our our. Our YouTube channel was like get, getting up, and we were thinking, oh, maybe we'll get some people coming to our show because Henry had that character that went viral, and oh, then he was playing Jados. And every night, it was just no one was coming, like no one was coming, and it was oh. like the show was really bad. Man, I had a Henry great year like, that year. Come get eggs, Benedict. Stop being weird. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, and I no. remember, I remember buying heaps of, and because you told me about bread top, that was when I first learned about bread top. And I, I was going to bread top and getting like, <laughs> I was getting like a loaf of white bread and then going to like Woolworths and just getting like, you know, you can get like Devon or whatever for like two ninety nine and I'm just going to just give me a kilo of that, like two ninety nine. It's three bucks for a What's kilo. What's Devon? Hands? It's like, like a processed meat. meat. Yeah. Lunch and but, meat. But meat. Like Greg, meat. Greg would eat meat. 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 Greg would eat like a loaf of that sugary soft bread top bread filled with Devon and he'd call it Greg top. <laughs> Yeah. Wait, a loaf? Yeah. Well, like, what, I don't know, like a big thing. And you're like, ah. <laughs> like, you'd cut a big thing. No, no, no. I, I'd, I'd get the individual slices and I'd get two and I'd make a sandwich yeah, yeah. of Devon and I would eat it. And then I'd go, hmm, maybe I'm a little bit hungry. Maybe I'll have a little, another little sandwich. Just a little. They're, they're small slices in the bread top. So <laughs> I'd put another couple of bits of lunch meat, like Devon on there, have a little sandwich. I was quite slim when I came down that first time. <laughs> You, do um, you you had lost a lot of. I mean, yeah, you were quite lithe. Yeah, I've, I. Yeah, you, you, what you were going to say is, I have gained a lot of weight. Yes, <laughs> correct. I've gained a significant amount of weight um, since I moved to Melbourne. Thank um, you so much. <laughs> at one point, you so Power World. At one point, is 
What when I they came down once, that... and you'd, you'd put on my you angry at the Greek community. What? What? I went, wait, 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 wait. wait. You, you were no defamation. At, no, you were furious at the Greek community for their delicious Euros culture in Melbourne, and you were trying to tell me that that was why you put on weight. Yeah. Like, it's because of all the Euros. You don't understand. Yeah. Everywhere I go, there's a delicious one on every corner. I'd never, I'd never, like, up in Queensland, we have kebabs, sure. <laughs> we got kebabs. We got kebabs for days. <laughs> But a souvlaki with the fucking chunks of lamb with the like the charcoal, you can't get that in Queensland. Mm. You can't get it. What am I supposed to do? I come down here. You, they, there's a fucking shop that sells du- plate of dumplings, eight ninety five for fifteen dumplings. What are you supposed to do when that happens? You go to Ballarat. They still got all you can eat Pizza Hut. The worst. Yeah. No. Someone did a shit in the toilet. They filled it to the brim. And then Xavier Michaelides had a look and he had to have a second look when he, before he left because it, it was just like, well, i got to have a second look. <laughs> Break for friends. <laughs> <laughs> that, like, filled it? Up to the bridge. It was still, that was, oh I, I couldn't understand. So this is what happened. This is what happened. I went into the Pizza Hut, all you can eat, all you can eat works, which by the way, is not as good as you remember. <laughs> <laughs> you go to Pizza Hut, all you can eat the works. It's not as good as you think it's going to be because you can get all the pizza you can eat for not that much at Pizza Hut. Like, and then you pay like 30 bucks to go in there. Anyway, we went in there, then I went to the toilet. The bowl was filled. Oh. I'm sorry, just <laughs> lock your ears. <laughs> So someone has done a shit in there. Okay, yeah. But then someone else has gone, okay. Oh, what? I'll do a second shit on top of that. Is that what happened? It must have. <laughs> how else is it filled up with that much shit? And then I came out and I just went, fuck, guys. Do not go in there. Do not go in there. The last stall, do not look. And then Xavier was furious. He just went, fuck. No, I have to see. <laughs> Like, I don't want to go. <laughs> but I have to see it. And then he walks in and comes back and goes, God damn it. Why did you all go to Ballarat? <laughs> was it just to go to Pizza Hut? No, I think it was like a live pod oh, situation. Okay. It was a gig situation. I think it was like right? Dum Dum or something. Oh, okay. Like it was, there was a bunch of people and we're all in Ballarat. Went to the Pizza Hut and yeah. Oh, uh, okay. Power World. <laughs> Um, tell, me about, tell me about these pals, Evan. Yeah. They're, they're actually, quite, there's a lot of similarities to Pokemon. I'm sure it's coincidental, but the, the pals themselves uh, look similar to look. some Pokemon. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Um, by similar, like, I legitimately am shocked that there isn't legal proceedings happening. Uh, is, is there some? Like that's, the, the, I'm looking at some footage. These all look like Pokemon. That, that, that's one. That is one. That's if I didn't Pokemon. know any better and someone showed me this, I'd be like, oh, there's a new Pokemon game. That's yeah. when I came in here. Yeah. The first thing I said was, oh, it's a Pokemon game? Right. Yeah. Um, and, you know, the, that though, sort it's, of... It's um, Pal World. No, it's Pal, Pal World. These are Pals, not Pokemon. A world of them. That a looks world, a lot like world. a Pidgey. Yeah. Yes? Oh, there's some head... Oh. Hello. Headlines. Bex put some headlines in the cheat sheet. Um, You can't click on these links, though. No, you just sort of... (laughs) Oh, yeah. (laughs) Um, Power World sells one million copies in eight days, Dev say. That's Gen 19. Is that good? Oh, oh, fun. That's a lot. Oh, this is good storytelling, Beck. Um, Power World's record-breaking launch contends with Baldur's Gate 3 as a survival... Hit exceeds 850,000 concurrent Steam players. That's so many. Yeah. Mm. Power World has huge weekend, sells 5 million and overtakes Cyberpunk 2077 and seems most played games list, IGN. Power World comes under fire for potential Pokemon plagiarism. <laughs> oh, okay. The Pokemon Proven. company makes an official statement on Power World. We intend to investigate. Power World is now the most p- played third-party game on Xbox Game Pass. Power World is the culmination of every game I've ever loved. It shouldn't work, but it does. Uh-oh. Um, this, uh, nah. it, so Nintendo is, yeah, they, all, they, all they've, as far as I know, all they've officially said is that they are in, that they're investigating, they're, they're looking into the, the situation. I believe they said that's Cap. What does that mean? Talk I think that's it. over now. I think that's Cap is done. Cap. Yeah. Cap. Yeah. Cappuccino? Cap is done. That's Cap. Long black. Huh? Hmm? <laughs> the, 
p uh, p p so pals, you go the the so okay so so that it's actually I, I enjoyed oh. this game much more than I thought I would. What game? I was like Power World. Yeah. I was like. I don't want to play this game, but then the show comes up, and I'm like, I don't want, because all I want to do. Don't you choose the game? Yeah, but I all I want to do is play Call of Duty, right? We already talked about Call of Duty on the Christmas episode of this show, and if you missed it, you can go watch it. The year before, and the year before, and you know, yeah, each year. Every year. But then the show comes up. I'm like, all right, we're going to play something else. And um, and oh, I thought, you, Power. You this every week. Oh well, this is the, well, not every week, but this is uh, the, this, this is the first week back. That's just that's just um, that's and we'll be doing it weekly. Just, yeah, they're all just Pokemon. That Ponyta, maybe? Yeah, like I could almost name the Pokemon I that... Like a shiny Ponyta! I did it! I think that's our Blastoise. My first video. shiny! <laughs> um, Ponyta, I've seen that video. Yeah. Great, but I, great I, impression. I, yeah. I thought, firstly, I thought, well, this looks like a silly game that's probably bad. Mm -hmm. And secondly, I don't really want to play it. But people are talking about it, so let's, mm -hmm. you know, maybe it's a good one to, to talk about on the show. And so I, I, and then it, it found out it's on Game Pass as well, which helps because you know it's, I've got Game Pass, so I can play it for free and just sort of see what it's like. Um, and I started playing it, and it's I, I actually I like it. I think I'm going to keep playing. It. I don't know if my character's still alive after what. what no, he died. Okay, yeah. right. they died. Okay. And came back to um, life after. They, they, they come back so to life. You just don't have any items or anything. Right after yeah, you go so back, you've lost all the stuff. You have yeah, gained yeah. the ability to suck your own dick though. Well, so well, I, well, <laughs> I threw like because there's like power balls. Yeah. I think I used all of them. Because I didn't know how. Oh, to, like I just kept throwing. Right, them. I'm gonna have to craft a bunch well. more of those. Yeah. So essentially, what you do is, um, is this? Sorry, it's, it's a, like a survival crafty sort of game. Mm -hmm. So, the first thing you do is you have to you like collect some wood. You know, you've got nothing, right? So you got you got to collect some wood. You got to collect some stone, and so you can sort of grab bits off the ground. You can go up to a tree and just sort of punch the tree, and wood when, will come out. Like but Minecraft. The, what, like Minecraft. When you're when you're when you capture a pal. Yes. Mm. Do you fight your pals against other people's pals, like you mm. would in Pokemon? You can, but I actually haven't been doing that. Why are you that. talking about Pokemon? Because well, we were just talking about how this is a rip-off of Pokemon. It's got nothing to do with Pokemon. This is Pal World. This is an original. This is Pal World. The Pokemon Company makes an official statement well, and they intend pals. to investigate it. Yeah, so I mean, but they haven't. Yeah, know, but it says so. here, that's shut just, up. That's just clout. That's just clout. <laughs> are, you in the, what are, you in the, are you in the pocket of Big Pal, pal World? Have you, have you been um, bought off by Big Pal? No, in fact, I hate Pal World so much. I actually hate... Yeah? This game makes me feel sick. Um, and that's not just the ongoing digestive. Yeah, it took you ten. It, it <laughs> took I, you ten seconds to come playing this game. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and that's actually pretty good for Greg. Yeah. yeah. Um, what, what, He's what aiming we, for five. What would be? But yeah, is that is it is, is it good if I come quick or is it? Oh, because weren't you saying the game before was going to make you come in five seconds? That's what an game impressive that? game. If it, but. The, ga the game you were, that was advertised to you, you'll come in five seconds. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You weren't last five minutes playing this game. <laughs> five minutes, it, yeah. was it? Or was it five seconds? Um, five minutes. I think I've got... Five seconds. Five seconds. I think seconds. I've got early onset Alzheimer's. Anyway. Okay. I think you might too. Power World sucks for so many reasons. Oh. Partly because, I mean, I, yeah. It Not just, trials. It looks terrible. Not trials. It, the, like, the graphics are awful. It's janky and weird and there's heaps of glitches. It's early access, that's fine, but... It's early access and it sold a million copies. It's yeah. like it's That's crazy. Why do yeah. why do people like On games no where it's like IP. oh I want to I want to I want to build a sword. All right, go fucking punch a tree, and then you just and then you just literally I was just going like, mm, mm, yeah, mm, mm, pretty basic mm. game mechanic. And then you go like, dude, I got wood. Cool. Yeah. I mean, there's a what lot of games about? like that. We're so bored. It's oh, just the most boring game. It's see, the most I think boring with, form of with, game. With these kinds of games, though, it's the the actual repetitive actions aren't interesting, mm. but they do get you to get get a shot of dopamine when you get to build something or make yeah, something. Yeah, that's so what that's, these games are. They're designed think, by someone. Yeah, but I think you like, were too incompetent. How do I get legal crack? Yeah, but I think you were too incompetent <laughs> to ever get any of the dopamine. I'm too smart. <laughs> No, I'm on. I'm on like a, another plane of IQ Reality. that you don't even understand. Okay, like it's actually hard to describe. So why did the why did Evan's character end up dead with no clothes then? Because Power World sucks. You ever seen the Dunning Kruger thing? Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Feel like you're on the, like the the high end. Yeah, I'm. I'm the. I'm the opposite of Dunning Kruger. Yeah, exactly. You're Kruger Dunning. Yeah, I'm Kruger Dunning. Like I'm. I don't. I like don't think I'm that intelligent, which means I'm really intelligent. And yeah. even the, even though I say I'm really intelligent, I'm even more intelligent than so I think that I am. What, what you know how Dunning Kruger? It's it's like if you think you're smart, you're probably not smart kind of thing. Or the dumbest yeah. people think they're smart. Yeah. What if everyone around you thinks you're a moron? Then you're probably stupid. That's called the Michael Hing <laughs> experience. <laughs> 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 Woo! Fuck, dude. I've 
Unfortunately, everyone... You got fucking roasted? <laughs> I don't think anyone believes, and no one watching this would believe that people think I'm stupid. Come on, Greg, please. I mean, uh, how, do we, how do we measure intelligence, really? There's no way. There's <laughs> no, no way, way to know. But like, it's um, so... I don't know how, but um, oh, you know, you to shoot I'm the obviously guns. in the minority. People like the gun. You, you can't shoot a gun. You I played watched, it for 10 minutes. Yeah, but I watched lots of videos about it. I it didn't takes play, very, I barely played it, it and I was a, like, this isn't fun, but I was also like, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Yeah. Oh, right. Yeah, it, it takes a very long time to get to guns. So that, that is something that I think is a bit disappointing when you first get into it. You're like, oh, I'm going to shoot some Pokemon. Um, but firstly, it's not Pokemon. Also, Greg was the whole time just, mm. just saying... How do I butcher him? How do I butcher yeah, him? Yeah, because you can't. I was googling like, how do you butcher yeah, a pal? Yeah, you, you can eat them. Because obviously you want to butcher the pal. If you, yeah, sure. And every time he went up and he clicked on the menu thing and it didn't say butcher, and then he yeah. was like, "How do you butcher him?" And then he just do it again. And I was like, "Greg, I don't think you can do it at this point Greg, in the game." Greg, did I, you start playing this game? And your immediate thought was, "How do I eat the pal?" <laughs> it wasn't my. Yeah, yes, but but not because of food. Because of how psycho that is. But then he just persisted. Like, it was obvious that he couldn't butcher them. Like, there was I was like, I need, to, I need to know how to butcher these fucking pals. But he, just kept, he kept hitting the same button. And then I was playing and he was like, hit this button and see if you can butcher the pals. And I was like, I already hit that button, like, but I'll hit it again. And then I was waiting until I got hungry. The pals. <laughs> <laughs> I, um, I like, maybe your hunger meter needs to be at a certain no, level. No, no, no. So I can I, butcher these fucking pals. I, I this so then I, he says I he googled it. Any pals. I googled it for Greg because I was yeah. watching him suffer because he just kept asking, "How do you butcher him? How do you?" Yeah, I was like, "I know there's a way to butcher him. I've seen it." I want, I want to eat this blastoids. Um, so you did need a meat cleaver, which we didn't have. Yeah, no, exactly. but you and could unlock that problem. technology. You want to do? Craft a, a I want to play cleaver. a fun game and butcher some pals. But it's like, <laughs> That's entirely no. up to you. No, I if you, no but if you want to butcher a pal, you got to go punch a tree for ten minutes, mm. and then punch rock for ten minutes, then build a crafting station. Sorry, I have, a quest- I have a question. Mm. Well, what did you do in that game trials? In the game trials, yeah, flips. <laughs> <laughs> like you just like you want to ride a motorbike? Yep. Fucking get into it. And then you just start. And then you just like everything you want to do, you can do straight off the bat. You want to do a flip? Flip up. Like flip, you can do flips. You you, you do courses where you try and get some okay. Some of the courses were speed based and other courses were trick based. Or like technical based. I do remember at one point we had to ask Greg to turn it down because um, we, we'd invited some comedian over to do a podcast and he was an American comedian and he was, he was, he was so baffled as to what Greg was doing that he couldn't, he was so distracted. This was a, a, a guy called Paul Provenza who was on it, came on yeah. Joe and he was so distracted by what you were doing, Greg, that we had to, he was like, can you just turn that off? Because it's so... <laughs> What? Was yeah. I, I, yeah, I have no memory of that. I just remember playing the game and, <laughs> and eating everyone. and eating my bread top. <laughs> and fucking try not to think about the show it, that I was doing each night that no one was coming to. It was a very funny show. I saw it. So yeah, you were just you were riding a motorbike. Yeah, doing flips, doing like crazy stunts, doing, doing jumps. jumps. Yeah, like at no point do they go, oh, if you want to ride a motorbike, you got to go and punch a rock. And mine, aluminium. So I, th- I think you just, but I feel you like don't that's like this in kind a of lot game. of games. I know, and a lot of games are really shit. <laughs> don't, but to, don't, don't, I mean, it's kind of fun to to go and capture these pals, and then they come and they work. On like it would be fun if it base. wasn't just a rip off of Pokemon, and they looked like different things. <laughs> but it's like, ah. Eh. It's just a crap. It's like this is like. But what if it was Pokemon? Just pretend that it's Pokemon. If it was Pokemon, then it'd be like, oh yeah. I mean, I don't like Pokemon. Okay. <laughs> you know, I fucking hate Pokemon, so I don't know. I don't think I've, I haven't played a Pokemon game recently, but are there, is there a, a sort of an open world Pokemon? Yeah. Uh, there is. Yeah, Apparently yeah, there are. Um, but I think, I, I think part of the problem for uh, Nintendo uh, is that this, I think this is better received than a lot, most Pokemon games. <laughs> I think this is uh, probably. Brutal. Better than because the last Pokemon, I mean, Pokemon. I guess they are all open world, but they're the very like it's very repetitive kind of. They're like, not open world. Are they open world? Or what would you describe them as? They're like the original Pokemon around. games aren't open world, are they? But like I, well, I guess they're they yeah. Well, you can kind of go wherever, can't you? Yeah. You um, have to follow the. 
I can't remember. Is, it, you is still it have free? To... Is this free early access? The, no, no, no. You have to buy, well, so it's free on Game Pass if you play it on Xbox or in the Windows Store, or you can buy it on Steam and it's well, at 45. How many people have bought it? Well, the, what, they, what did they say? A million people? A million, they're, five they're, million? They're the, they're the amount of people that have actually bought it, not just Game Pass got it. Uh, yes, we're talking about um, sales. Sales. I, sales. Thought, I thought it was a Ow. joke because it's so obviously a ripoff of Pokemon. They're not Whoa. just a ripoff of Pokemon, but like the worst, like, POW world. <laughs> like, it's funny. It's funny in the sense that it's like, it's like when that, you, you know, what's that meme where it's like when you say you want McDonald's and mum's like, we got McDonald's at home. And then it's just this crappy. Yeah. This is exactly that. It's like. Oh, POW world. It's POW yeah. world. Yeah. Like, it's I'm like. It's got POW world again. POW yeah. world. Yeah. It's like what Nana gets you for world. Christmas People when like you wanted it. Pokemon. Yeah. Sorry. People like it. Yeah. People do like, I like it. <laughs> I liked this. I liked put caption POWs. I like, uh, you know, putting them to work. Uh, getting them to build things. Well, that's not surprising because you do have a history of enjoying shooting dogs in games. And it seems to be a similar thing because you're just attacking these ki tiny, cute animals that are running around. Yes, yeah. although you're not trying to kill them. Sometimes you kill them accidentally. What's your history of shooting dogs in games, Evan? Well, I... Red Dead? I, I, Loves to do it. Uh, well, no, I mean... He prefers I, I, it <laughs> <laughs> to a game where you, where you don't... Where you can't shoot the dog. Yeah, sure. He's a shoot dog game rather than a non shoot dog. He's like you know Wolfenstein. He could shoot the dog and then. Yeah, but that's a vicious duty. pack dog. Oh yeah, well, yeah, sure. I mean, yeah, I'm not. I'm not shooting so you, a little. Do you puppies, have a list so in your head of all the games where you can shoot a dog? Is no, that your primary? Just, yeah, you really started at the genesis of it's dog shooting. It's more intuitive than like, that. <laughs> <laughs> like you've immediately just gone. Yep, let's start from the beginning. So if I I'm named it, if I named a game, would you be able to tell me if you can kill a dog in it or not? I don't think I'd have that. But I, I, th I feel like that's a that's probably a website. Um, Oh no, that's not, is that a film that does the dog die or something? Oh, can sorry, I get it. Can you the dog or does the dog, the dog die? The dog. Not can you kill the dog. Right, that's, right. <laughs> for some reason, that one isn't, doesn't have a market yet. Right, could if I, could I kill it, a dog like, in Halo? I, I, no, I don't think there are dogs in Halo. See? See? I don't uh, think there are. Last of Us. <laughs> there you go. Not, even, not after Evan was oh, done with them. Last of <laughs> I think the second one, yes. Yeah, the second one. I don't second, think the first one. The second one, you can shoot a dog, stab a dog, or set one on fire with a Molotov cocktail. Yeah, right. That's it? Uh, no, like shoot with arrows as well as right. or hit yeah, it with a bullets. brick, hit it with a glass, but that's not going to kill it. When you hear them yell out, because in The Last of Us 2, the dogs have names, do you love that? <laughs> mm. So you I, know I who you're killing? Like, yeah. I didn't like the dogs at all. Killing? When they're like, Bruno! Oh, after you've... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You love that? I mean, I liked that it was... Um, I thought it was a nice touch. Yeah, exactly. Um, <laughs> they're doing new things with the form. Mm. Yeah. Uh, and that's the storytelling we need to be teaching our kids. Twisting the knife, yeah, and that's... You know, when they twist that knife, that's, that's your, like... You know, play this game for five seconds without coming. <laughs> This game, people we that chat. We like that chat. <laughs> yeah, chat loves this. Someone says that "Can You Jesus Kill the Christ. Dog" is available as a demo. Jesus. Oh, right. Well, maybe we should it's get that going. Become evidence one day. Lots of little dogs fighting around. Oh, they like that. See, <laughs> evidence like in it. what? What do you think this is going to be evidence for? Oh, when Evan kills a dog. <laughs> I don't want to kill a dog. That's a horrible thing to do. Has anyone ever gone on a dog Practice killing that. spree? Jimmy, are you asking, are you asking the viewers or are you asking in, in historical life? terms? In historical times. Like, has, oh. has there ever been a news report where there, like 50 dogs have been killed, like this crazy guy like ran around just killing dogs? I think, I think there's definitely people who have been like like poisoning like uh, like footpaths or in the, in the dog park or something like that. Well, yeah, they, people yeah. poison dogs. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's definitely You, you poison happens. dogs? No. No. Not intentionally. No. Right. But you, are, you, do, you do... We've all accidentally Everyone poisoned a few dogs. Oh, obviously. Yeah, I'm not like a perfect person. <laughs> Um, I, uh, uh, some people have said that this is kind of like slavery. I've killed heaps of cats. Power what? Hmm? You've killed heaps of cats. For the environment. Yeah. They're pests. Yeah, they are pests. How, but do you, do you take them pests. to, a, do you take them to a, like a shelter and they do it or do you do it yourself? I'm not going to clog up the shelter system with a bunch of admin and you yeah. have extra work to do. So what no, do you, I, I agree with that. Put them in a bag and then put the bag in a ocean? Is this what you would think? Put him in a bag, put, throw the bag in the ocean. It's, yeah, obviously, I put him in a bag and I put him in the ocean. Yeah. I'm Evan just trying to think, how do we, how do we get this back on track? It's it's cow. How else would you do it? <laughs> how else are we talking about, how can we what? talk about these pals? I, I, I wouldn't know, I wouldn't know. I've never killed a cat. I'm asking you because you're the expert. It's, um... You think you're so good. <laughs> it's kind yeah, of... Yeah, I guess I do think I'm pretty good that I haven't killed a cat. 
Well, then you're solely responsible for what? Ani- let's go around and say what animals. For the fact that I don't see any superb fairy wrens. Let's say what animals we have killed, either intentionally or non-intentionally. Insects, bugs don't count. Oh damn! Like cockroaches or ants or whatever. Intentionally how big, or unintentionally. How big do they have to be to yeah, count? But you, but you have directly killed. Them. I don't think I've. I mean, maybe like a fish that I, as a kid, didn't take care of. Mm-hmm. But that's probably. I don't think I've ever killed anything bigger than a fish. Mm-hmm. I can. Or does like a man count? Or man is the most dangerous animal of all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, that one. Uh, it's weird that you that you that I don't you. I think I've killed anything bigger than a bug. I've killed lots of fish. Why? Fishing. On purpose? Oh, fishing. Oh, fishing. oh right. <laughs> I've, I've killed oh, fish, right, right, right. crabs, yabbies. Great. I've killed a bird like by accidentally hitting it with a car. Oh, oh that's unfortunate. Um, Did you think this was going to be a fun chat? I once saw my sister kill a bird on my birthday. You're like someone playing Never Have I Ever and just like <laughs> drinking. Um, it's just on how many what animals, animals have we you've killed? killed. I once went on a hunting safari in Africa. Where I, <laughs> um, Sorry, Evan, what were you saying? Uh, it's, I was just, uh, pointing out that it's kind of weird that you, you, you attack them and then you capture them mm. and then they're just quite happy to work for you in your base. But they, these aren't, are these sentient, do we think, these pals? I think oh, they're they sentient they're, as hell. They're, look at that, they're, they're, look at that they're, they're, smile on that gun one. <laughs> like, that one's like, I'm yeah, he's ready to go. They're, 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 they're he's got a real Greg energy, that guy. <laughs> but like, yeah, but that's realistic, like if you... If you <laughs> what? <laughs> I think Greg, if Greg had a big gun like that, he would get the exact. Fat pal. (laughs) (laughs) I'm your big fat pal. Okay, yep. Sure. I would say. Beat me with a stick and put me in a ball and send me to work and feed me berries and meats (laughs) and different snacks. You just want me to feed you. Because I'm a pal. Okay. Make me eat these red rock. (laughs) Oh. No, no, no one's the, making you eat those. Guys. He's the pal. He's in the tippies. Yeah. There's That's who a, you think I Greg, am. Greg, there's one on your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Greg, I'm sorry. I feel like there was a misunderstanding with what I was saying. I was talking more about the, his sort of grin as he was sort of holding a gun and shooting people. Oh, yeah. my God. Sort of a, because you talked about killing animals, it was a sort of a psycho thing. That was kind of what I was. I was so transparent. I was doing like a, like a comedic, I did, I, I did I was doing mean, a comedic riff. I didn't mean to imply That's that. That's what I sounded like when I was getting bullied in high school. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, no, I was yeah. not on it. No, um, I was, yeah, I know, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> I, yeah, totally, dude. <laughs> so... So anyway, we're all I, running away they're, from they're, nothing. Once, once you, once you capture them, they're quite. They're, they're, you build up. You know, you get, you get. You basically, you capture as many as you can, and you, and you put them to, to work. They've, you know, and then they'll, they'll, they'll help you out and do stuff. Such a lovely, so water lovely, your plants. So, you know, system in Power World that you just beat and capture. Yes, and then they work until they die. Yeah. They right. uh, die. Do the pals die in this? So you've got to oh, get yeah, new you, ones. I mean, got... I killed like seventeen of them straight off the bat. <laughs> I don't know how you, you don't kill, like, because I was like trying to interact with them in ways that weren't killing them. Well, you were trying to butcher them. Yeah, I was trying to butcher them. <laughs> I mean, mostly I all you a video can, where you can butcher them. All you can really do, as far as I know, is is att- is attack them. Mm. Greg was just walking up to them while they were asleep in the, I guess, compound, um, and just like beating them up. Just yeah, and they don't even them. wake up. I guess you can mount some of your pals. Fuck them. <laughs> well, you can mount them. I think everyone wants to know if you can fuck them. <laughs> I, um... You know, you can't really whisper because you're wearing a microphone. I wasn't... Well, who was whispering? <laughs> you, when, you, when you sort of was put your hand over your mouth, Greg. Like you fuck. <laughs> yes. But we don't know who said that. Yeah, you don't um, know who said that. Well, I think we could all tell you said it because you, you can, can see all our mouths. Our mouths aren't moving. You yeah. can yeah. breed Anyone. them. You can breed them. You can breed them. Well, yes. Not with you, though. But you can't breed them with you. So I, you can't have, like, a pal... And a power man. Not power as far as I know. No, you can, you can, you can breed them, and you can, you can uh, breed different species uh, together. Oh, you can, you can mix them. Okay, oh, look yeah. at all these pals. You Which one do you them? think you yeah. could make come? The oh, fastest? that's really Greg fucked up. I feel. Hey, uh, Why is it that fucked pink up? One. How are they close that enough for you to breed them together? I mean, they're all pals. Like labradoodles. <laughs> it's really two separate conversations going yeah. on. Is there? What was your what conversation about? about? He. he <laughs> Repeat what you said. Repeat what you said. Repeat I said, said, when there was the, the sort of the image of all the pals, yes. I was like, look at them all. Which one do you think you could make come the quickest? Oh. And Greg said the little pink one. Yeah. No. How would you do that? What, you, what do you why, mean? How, why would you say that? 
<laughs> what do you mean? Because it... You are an idiot. Forge? Well, which one would you pick then, Naomi? The most masculine looking one. <laughs> <laughs> the Greg one. <laughs> it's a... <laughs> Ten seconds tops. <laughs> Um, I just spit on it. Look, look. Oh. I. <laughs> it's so easy. <laughs> you just spit on it. Just spit on it. They can't. You just that the 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 the, the, the yellow Greg one. Just spit mm. on his face or whatever. Yeah. I didn't say face. <laughs> um, I uh, man, I mean, we should. Probably, I think feel like we've we've the, this we've. But I feel like we're trading some really good ground. Out of yeah, we're just getting warmed up, brother. We should. Ra I think we should wrap up. But um, uh, I'm just seeing if there's anything else. Uh, there's over 100 different pals. Um, to How many? Like 150. Anything pal? Um, I don't know. I don't think there's there are pals. There's, but there's, there's, there's a whole world of pals. Um, the sort of playing of pals. Because I hadn't watched the whole episode of this before. Gaging battles, captain yeah. pals. I guess what I hadn't realised is the, the the prime dynamic of this. Is uh -huh. that you've set up all of this. Yes, and yet you don't. And you don't get to do the thing you want to do. Yeah, mm. and and it's sort of like it's sort of like a it's sort of like a, I guess it's like an ancient curse. <laughs> Good, right? Like, is like you you you've put up all this is like this is incredible. You know what I mean? The, yeah. Like Thank I can't. You. And all you I don't want, know how much these LED screens cost, but so much. And yeah. all you want to do is talk about your pal world video game. Yeah, uh -huh. look, it's a gamey game controller. You've, you've like put in someone so much effort, that. and then you come here every week. And all Greg wants to do is talk about making the little pink one come and Naomi's talking about spitting on him and, you know, I'm not helping obviously as well, you know, it's um, just, and it's, it's sort of like a... It's edging. It's edging. <laughs> <laughs> Greg edged too much. <laughs> and that's what happens. What does... I... Okay, I don't think I... No, I didn't break the chair. What happened was, you know, okay. In a chair, there's like a little bar that you pull out and it is, is free to rock. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you yeah. push it in and it is locked. Yeah, yeah. That bar, I reckon, was like just on the edge of uh -huh. in and out. And I just <laughs> leaned back and it's tipped over the edge. But now it's in and it's fine. Okay. okay. So you like, yeah. <laughs> and so, like, there's no broken chair here. It's fine. Yeah. <laughs> um, great. Okay. Maybe we, I, I think, I think, look, the, I think you kind of got the gist of the game. Give it a go. It's it's free on. Um... Do you review the game at the end of the show? Do you go? No, I not it, really. I give it eight. Greg's out of ten or whatever. No, I don't think. I mean, you can if you like. If you want to. Greg, how many Greg's out of ten do you give it? Eight. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you hated it. Eight seems huh? like a good score. I thought you hated it. It's eight Greg's. Eight See Greg's. what you've done to him. Because I want to eat some food. <laughs> I want to eat. Um, <laughs> eight. He thinks eight Greg's is eight, bad. Eight. eight, eight. <laughs> <laughs> He thinks the more Greg's, the worse it is. Because that's what you've instilled in him. I've been very encouraging of Greg. Do you... Do you... <laughs> I remember when I used to get bullied at school and I'd cry myself to sleep and then I'd be like, one day I'll have friends. <laughs> yep. Did that... Huh? Did that happen or is it... I'm sure there's someone. Yeah. But you got over 100 pals. I killed them all. <laughs> I killed all the pal. Um, do you? Uh, uh, okay. Do you? You, hate, you, you don't like? You, you're not a fan I of this game. You, do you, I, I didn't you play it, but I would. I would play this game. You I would play would enjoy it? it a lot. Yeah. Do, uh, Naomi, have you, have, did you, you played a little bit? Do you want to play more? You I think I was stuck in a situation where I didn't understand what was happening, but I think I would enjoy this game. But I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> okay. Because I'm just, you know. Because you spend all your time now doing yoga, Naomi. Yeah, mm. I'm really strong now, actually, Evan. We're doing heaps of yoga. Blech. Is that true? Blech. There's a lump there. Blech. Yeah. Well, Looks these like lights you get are that checked out. That lump. It's like a growth. Yeah. Mm. Are you scared? <laughs> I'm terrified. You should be. I've been doing a lot of yoga. I'm really strong now. That's and then great. the burping thing. Yeah. I'm health no, maxing at the yeah, moment. Yeah. Totally. That's so great. So there's no way in fucking hell that I would right. open this up on the computer because it would just revert me yeah, to. Yeah. Yeah. You know. Or are you more of a you more of an NTSC world? I don't know if I should be here anymore. <laughs> I don't think this is a good. I don't think this is um, in line with my goals. <laughs> Evan, Evan was making a joke about different formats. Mm. Yeah, yeah, it's sort of a yeah. region kind of thing. Well, um, thanks everybody for tuning into another episode uh, of Greg Time Power World. Greg. I can do crow pose. What's crow pose? Is it like a cronut? It's exactly like a cronut. That's where it comes from. <laughs>
Um, yeah. Uh, let, um, Power World is out now on PC and Xbox and is included with Game Pass. Um, you, you can play it on Game Pass see if you like it. You can buy it on Steam. Um, the Steam version is a bit more, uh, it's, a, it's a, a newer build or whatever. I think it's, a, it's, a, it's uh, more stable, more stable, better, more performant. It's got a patch. Uh, yeah, I think it's been patched, whereas the, the Game Pass version is, is not quite up to date. Um, but I've been playing it on Game Pass. It's fine. Like it'll, it's fine. It's just a bit stutterier and stuff. I, mm. I think, like, legitimately, there's no, there's no reason to get a donut now that cronuts did this. Like, they are better in every way. No, but not everyone really sells that. cronuts. No, yeah, that's true. But like, if you like have a, the option of getting a cronut versus a donut, really? Well, no, no, because no, they're so good. But a cronut yeah. would never be jelly filled. Mate, come to the Preston Market. <laughs> I'll show you a place that has a jelly filled cronut. Yeah, I think I think cronuts are usually filled with stuff. Yeah. Really? Yeah, I mean, they've got all the holes and the, they've got all the layers of pastry. You can yeah, fit you can stuff fill in. Up a cronut with anything you like. Like an almond croissant. <laughs> Soggy <laughs> cronut. I think um, I, I think I prefer a donut to a cronut. What kind of donut do you? Pick? Let's not. We, is okay. I like like a cinnamon donut, like you know, just like a fluffy, you know. Yeah. Um, yeah. 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 Do people yeah. tune into the show to get information about video games? I don't no. think so. No, never. I think they're smart. That's never happened. That. Right. No. In fact, uh, they get offended when we have real opinions. <laughs> right. You should check the comments when I said I didn't like Hades. They were. They were like, <laughs> Sometimes I have to remind myself that these people aren't games critics because the stuff <laughs> Naomi was saying was just like really out of line. <laughs> um, before we wrap up, we have to thank our top patrons. Amy G, Blake Hannikin, Brendan Wozni, Cameron Fullwood, Chris Potts, Christian Sanchez. Oh, no, I said it. You should have said that. Oh, Christian Sanchez. Oh, okay. David Bourne, David Holland, Death Wombat, Decay, Dummy Thick Dave, Fahad Altani, Hannah Green, Jack Sanguinetti, Jim Bates, Jimmy Jojo Jr. Shabadoo, MJ, Oscar A, Recon7474, Suntry Raikkonen, Sean Prague, Stupid Old Scott McEachin, Siraj, and XZ Neil. If you want to hear your name read out on the show, sign up to the close personal friend Patreon tier. Um, and you get all the benefits of signing up to the Patreon. You get into the Discord. You get, uh, you get episodes. Love it in there. The, yeah, you're always in there. You're always, I'm always in there. It's all good about stuff. I love going on Discord on my phone and on my computer. Yep, that's where it is. I'm on Discord right now. Really? Yep. Oh, you are. I've got a little Discord. Yeah. Talking about all of you guys. Ooh. What are you saying? Here with all my best friends. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Um. I think this is the real power world. This or that. This is the power this world. Is the power this is the world. A world of pals. Pals. Um, and you can also get a mug. I love on you the, guys. If you want to get a mug, you can, you can on the Patreon as well. Go to patreon.com slash game and game. Would it be crazy if we all made a friendship pact or like... Yeah, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would, like imagine if we all made a pact to be best friends forever. Um, yep. What? If we made a pact, you know, it'd be oh, best friends be forever. As long as it's like a private thing. Yeah. We don't have to tell anyone about it, right? No, no, no. Just because there might be like other people who would be like offended if I said yeah. that like I had like other best friends or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, I yeah. would be, you would be the real best friends. But they're just, you know, politics. It's Greg, right? Okay. It's Greg, Greg. I'm not Greg, right. Greg. <laughs> um, Greg Larson. Where can people find you, Greg? You say Larson? Um, Larson? I said Larson. <laughs> Larson, um, like Arson. What, my, like, an address? <laughs> no, I mean... I see you frequent. Hey, we, people, you're doing a show oh. at the comedy... We took a oh, photo yeah. of you. Oh, it? yeah, yeah, you took a photo of me. Um, n nude photos, not of me. Not of you, nude, no. nude people in the photos. That's true. Um, I'm doing a comedy show. It's called Revolting. Mm. Perth, Adelaide, Melbourne, Sydney, maybe more. I think Brisbane, Brisbane? is about to be announced soon. Canberra? Nah. Fuck them. <laughs> what am I going to do in Canberra? It's called Revolting. It's My name's nice. Greg. Birds. Please See this? tell people written. about it. Greg lasted about 10 seconds. It's pretty hey. funny. <laughs> That's seconds, pretty then. good. Darwin, not doing Darwin, sorry. <laughs> Toowoomba, nah. But Brisbane, you know, whatever. Oh, there's like a bunch of like Twitch people in who are there who, like J Jube Jello, I know. Geelong. I don't know that nah. name. Uh -huh. But yeah, Melbourne, Bre Revolting, Greg Larson. See it. I'm begging you. All right, great. Uh, Hing, where can people find you? Uh, the oh, project? You know, yeah, I'm around. Okay. okay. <laughs> I don't think I'm doing much lately, so you don't have to, you know. But I'm around. Okay. Right. You know. Fair enough. Naomi, are you up to anything? You... Same old stuff. Same old I might stuff. be doing something soon. You I might actually soon. have something to plug soon, but. Really? 
That's, That's exciting. Nice. What a tease. That's what they say about me. <laughs> Uh, That's what Kevin said about you. <laughs> no, they didn't call me a tease. <laughs> <laughs> um, hey, if you enjoy the show, you can subscribe to the channel and uh, and uh, stuff like that. Or oh, you can podcast the show as well. Um, it's true. Yeah, on uh, you know Spotify and other uh, podcast apps. I think it's probably everywhere. We're on the uh, you know all the apps, right? All the apps. You know the. No, you know, the is there a is there a gamey gamey game app? No, should there be? I don't think there should be. I, I think, think it's time. Resources, you think so? Yeah, I think whatever Apps Jeremy Renner did. To, oh yeah, we okay. Just do that. Warno app. <laughs> who said who said that? We'll never know. Yeah, why are oh. you like this season two? We did the first one two three years ago. How's the chair and going, Greg? Like, I was time. mucking around with it, but that, I wasn't intending to do it a second time. Um, hey, thanks so much for watching, guys. We'll uh, we'll catch you next week. Bye. <laughs> Greg, don't. <laughs> I, I got a membership at a new gym. Okay, cool. And I um, have complained to them officially <laughs> about the smell of the gym. It actually smells so, it's insane. It's a new gym. And I like, okay. like sent an email going, hey, there's a fuck <laughs> smell at this gym. Like it's actually, it's, 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 you can't deal with this. Yeah. Okay. What did they That's why I'm not working out at the moment.